Hello guys and welcome to Tactical Gear Review Channel and today we have the Condor Backpack for review. So Condor is a well-known United States company but actually they make their products in China. Actually I have here the 3-day Condor Assault Backpack so it's made for 3-day battlefield or if you are a tourist and you like to hike with, uh, tourism, with tactical backpacks uh, it's good for 3 days. So if you want to know I have here the OD Green um, backpack but if you like you have the multicam ATAX or any other color camouflage you like use this backpack for military and I actually hiked with this backpack so I can tell you the cons and pros of the corner backpack so let's begin the first I really like is the mole system I really like mole system because I can put any uh, pouch I like here 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 you have here you have a velcro panel you can put any patch you want for a military or your airsoft games so let's start from the back system actually very good very padded but it does, does not have 3d mesh so you sweat a lot the shoulder pads are very padded and they have seven centimeters in the wide padded and they actually have thickness of one centimeter so the shoulder straps are not so soft and not so hard so they're actually comfortable so they lay down on your shoulders very convenient so here we have the chest strap buckle um, to prevent uh, the, the shoulder straps to slide from your shoulders. Actually I think they designed it too low, it's not comfortable, it actually uh, goes under your chest and I don't like it. I would like the strap to be higher uh, because in this design position it's too low and very awful and uncomfortable to walk. In the back system we have a plastic insert with um, aluminium a line um, it's really padded as you can see as I said before but no through the mesh so you will sweat a lot it's actually have a, a half centimeter thickness of padding uh, very good you actually have a waist belt but it's too soft so it does not support your back and your weight still will be on the shoulders on the shoulder straps um, so you actually can take it off I, I like it H however it does not help a lot but still I like the waist uh, belt. The buckles are good, I have this bag for three years and they are still uh, not broken. What I really like about tactical bags is that you have the velcro so you can roll up your uh, straps, additional strap that you leave and it does not disturb you. Also you have here the quick release buckles if you go in the field and you are a soldier and you have to uh, drop your backpack very fast you can just click the buckle and the backpack will fall. On the backpack you have three handles, one on the left and on the upper side and the right side so you can take your bag in any position in your hand very fast and very convenient. Um, also you have the side uh, also you have the side tightening straps so you can make your backpack as small as you can. Uh, you have double straps at the upper side and the uh, bottom sides so you can actually tighter your social coat or uh, your tent. On the side of the bags you have two small apartments for your bottle or any gear you want. I uh, just put there my bottle and actually some rope. You actually have a mold system uh, on the sides if you like more pouches to add at the side. At the bottom you have crinkles so you can drain your water if you go with the backpack to water mission. Also you have the moldy system at the bottom so you can attach your sleeping bag or sleeping mat at the bottom. Here we, so here we have the organizer, the bottom the bottom apartment for your uh, small gear. I actually use it for batteries and some power banks. As you can see we have mesh pockets so you can actually put anything you like it, and it won't go messy. Uh, you have three mesh pockets and one pocket on the zipper, big one. And the big one I actually uh, actually use for power banks and the small ones for batteries and you also have more space if you like a space for solar folding panel if you like to put there. Here you have a side big compartment for documents I actually use it for gloves and hats uh, when I went to hike in the military I used this for uh, gloves and some documents that I put there and here and here we have the bigger compartment organizer for actually your radio for anything you like as you can see there are <laughs> space for pens for your cell phone magazines you have also a uh, thing for your keys and 
and the multiple compartments for anything you need. If you like, you can put there your tablet or uh, any military or police tablet. Let me show you how do I organize this backpack for everyday use. Let's close this apartment and continue to review our Condor backpack. What I really liked about this backpack is that it has four zippers on one uh, apartment so you can actually uh, get access to your gear from any angle that you want. I also like that out. I also like that this backpack opens like a chimadan and you uh, can see all your stuff immediately. In the backpack that you can see that it has a hard shell back so it's plastic and aluminum as I said before it has four straps as buckles so you can tuck your gear inside and it won't jiggle uh, to any direction so you can actually put anything you want and your gear that you have and and actually make two layers of gear on the photo you can see that I tie my gear with the straps I mostly use these uh, straps to make two layers uh, for my gear so I can just take what I need in the first day and uh, take what I need in the second day without problem also you have two mesh pockets for your uh, stuff I used it for my uh, I use it for my towels and my underwear so actually you can put your uniform in the uh, main section and in the second mesh seconds you can put your socks, your underwear and your towel. So in the last section you can put your water bladder. Actually you can put two water bladders uh, of the size of 3 liters. Also you can put your ceramic plate if you like ESAP or SAPI plate in the backpack if you need more, uh, if you need a backpack with protection. Also, if you use this backpack for work, you can easily put their 15-inch uh, uh, laptop. Here you can see the plastic with the metallic uh, strip. As you can see, it's pretty thick and hard, so the backpack will be hard shell and comfortable for you to wear, even if you have something very, very heavy in your back. So in conclusion, I do recommend to buy this backpack. There are many better backpacks on the market, but for the price of Condor backpack, it's a good backpack. So please like the video if you liked it and comment below and actually subscribe to my channel. Thank you.